hello and welcome back to my youtube channel it's Dawn here so today we are here with casper the cat we're going to be making today um yeah an envelope card i'm loving doing these i've done them a few times now on the, the channel so we're going to do it again because yeah i have millions of envelopes and why not first up we use some five by seven envelopes we're going to stick them together so i'm just putting glue on this side and then I'm putting glue on this side, like this, okay. And then what we're going to do is we're going to slide this side in here, like this, until it won't slide anymore. Fold it over, and then we're going to fold over this bit and squish it down. So, there it is. That's as easy as that. That is our card this all done so this is perfect i think for if you want to give you know gift cards for christmas or birthdays or money or anything because you've got those pockets there so i, I do think this is a lovely so or if you've got tickets to go somewhere i think it is a lovely idea so first off we'd like to cut our layers of cardstock so we're gonna do the this one which is the wood grain so let's cut it down first Okay, take those white edges off and then we're going to cut it to size. Okay, so I want a piece that is um, four and three quarters by six and three quarters. Okay, so that is going to sit there. Um, I'm going to get another piece and we're going to do the same measurement. This will be for the back. So I'm just going to cut that off. Again, I'm just going to cut all my white edges off um, so that they are gone. Right, so um, four and three quarters by five and three quarters. So that's the front and the back. Now the inside, I'm going to have this green um, swirly patterned paper. So again, let's take off our white edges and we're going to cut exactly the same size uh, paper for these as well so um, four and three quarters by six and three quarters let's do another one and then we'll go from there okay so just trimming these down. Right, so four and three quarters by six and three quarters. Okay, so that is those done. Let me move them up there just for now. Um, I am going to grab my corner rounder and we are going to round the corners. I'm just going to do the quarter of an inch side though. So it's just a slight round okay and i'm gonna do it with all of them can i do them all together it'll save time won't it <laughs> okay like this and of course we can right okay now let's glue them into place so they're for the inside these are for the outside Okay, so I'm just going to glue everything down. Okay. Like this. Gorgeous. And then do the same with the back. Like so. Now I'm going to bring in my um, sentiments from my bit box because I have lots of them. So I'd like to use them up before I start bringing other things in. And then these are just going to go in here. Now what I'm going to do is actually pop glue just along this envelope here. And then just around these sides. And that should. And then if I just pop a bit of glue in there. That will make it so that we don't get glue on that open section there so there's one side okay 
and then let's do the same with that so I'm going to just glue around those three edges and then we're just going to glue around this edge and then fill in this bit with glue okay and then we're going to just line that up hopefully and stick that down so that is the base of our card done now if you didn't want to put anything in these pockets just glue the whole thing um you don't have to have you know anything in the pockets but i like to keep them open i just think it's quite nice now i'm going to grab our casper um and i want one of the big the big um pieces why do i put my scissors and there they are um and i'm gonna have two of them both facing the same way so that's a lot what i might do is actually instead of having i'm gonna have a big one and a little one there we go okay so let's cut these out now they are super quick at cutting out and quite simple so apart from the whiskers let's see i would say um that's the only sort of annoying bit uh, to cut out but if you are cutting if you're kiss cutting them so without the white border then I would personally just cut off the whiskers and then draw them on when you've stuck it down um, so yeah oh dear I went a bit close then what was I playing at right okay so just doing this and then I want to get some fish, some of the fish out to decorate. The, I want one on the back and one on the, and a couple in the inside. So it's going to be quite a simple design, I think, but hopefully will look absolutely gorgeous. So just going to keep cutting these out. Um, you can also do some ink blending if you wanted to. So if you, you know, if um, you find that the white's too stark, um, just grab some um, vintage photo would work well with this um, and it would help that just blend in. So if you didn't want to cut up really close, then you can just use your ink to blend it in. I personally, as you know, love the white. Um, I love it that it makes the image pop. So, so there we go mum and baby i love it let me grab my sentiments out um and see what we have um sprinkle oh i like that sprinkle kindness wherever you go that just seemed to like pop out at me and it needed to be so that's what we're going to use yeah oh look at that that was that was just meant to be that was definitely definitely meant to be so i'm going to glue all of this down like i said keep it nice and simple but if you haven't tried making one of these envelope cards yet i oh, highly recommend doing it it is so much fun and it's just something a little different as well so there's mommy and then we've got baby so let's glue baby down i mean in theory we could have a third okay and then let's stick these down and the green just looks beautiful on that cover as well i'm liking that okay so there's that and i really don't want to put anything else on that i think that looks really nice and then we're going to open up and inside this is where i'm going to grab the fish so uh we want a couple of big ones i'm gonna have those and then we'll do these as well now i am going to keep a white border on um i could actually just use the ephemera pack to save me cutting these down but there you go um i'm in the mood for fussy cutting i think okay and we're just going to decorate it all with um yeah with the fish and then i'm going to have a look through the sentiment box again to see if there's anything that i can sort of put on the inside um so that you know would be quite nice and i think we'll be done 
So, right, okay. So there's one fish. Now I'm liking the big ones. So let's do them. Oh, my tummy is really rumbling. It needs to be here itself. Right. So I'm sorry if you can hear it. Hopefully you can. I mean, I know you'll probably be able to hear the lady because she is snoring in the background. Right, I want one of these ones for the back because I think just at the bottom, or actually, no, I think I might have one of the little ones at the back. Okay, and the good thing about these is you can face them any way you want because it is just a silhouette. Right, okay. So I'm thinking things like that. This one, yeah, I'm going to have that just at the bottom there. So let's put some some glue on. Although maybe could have had a, a bigger one, but yeah, I think that's fine. Now I'm going to get a little one, so let's cut this out. These ones I find really quick and easy to cut out. I like these ones, right. Because so what I'm thinking is, and I've got a sentiment, have them two there but I'm going to have this one sort of around here somewhere um now I do have some really nice these ones like positive words this one says daydream I quite like that um let's have a look what else do we have be kind nope not the right one um, oh, could you use the thank you? The thank you might be nice. I like that. Um, and then we've got here comes the sun, but I don't think that applies to the fish. Um, what else do we have? Oh, you are awesome. I like that. So let's make this a positive one. Um, pop some champagne, no, uh, what's that one, goodbye stress, oh wouldn't that be lovely, wouldn't that be lovely, um, today is the day, no, let's go outside, no, because the fish is outside, oh, capture this moment, I like that one, um, let's see what else, oh <laughs> you're such a weirdo, Give that one to my husband. Work, work, work. Yep, that's all I ever do. Uh, live the life you love. Right, okay, I've got a few there. Um, so let's see. Let's see what we can what we can do. Because I think let's have lots of sort of inspirational bits and pieces on here. Um, because I think that would work quite nicely. So we're gonna have you are awesome. And I'm going to leave the inside, so I'm not going to do any journaling cards or anything because um, I think I'm going to leave it till when I actually want to use this. Um, and then I'll fill it then and do what I need to. Um, oh, that one can go there. Live the life you love. I think everybody should if they could. And then, so it's amazing what you can do with a few sentiments. I do have a new... Uh, word journal pack um journal words pack one um but i really want to use a lot of these first which is why i haven't sort of dipped into it okay and then this one i'm gonna have this one here because i love how that looks let's straighten this because that just annoys me when they don't cut them out straight okay and then that bit, get rid of those bits. Let's do that, which is there. And then we're finishing off with another fish. Okay, just like that. The only other thing is, do I want to add one of the, the 
hats. Let's have a look. I mean, if I don't, then fair enough. But I don't know, I just want to try. So that's what we're going to do. Okay. I'm just hopefully it won't take me too long to do this. Right, okay. Nearly done. Right, there we go. So I was thinking, do I want to have one of the little cats just sat somewhere? Like, I think that would be a bit too much actually. Yeah, way too much. So I'm loving, I'm loving what I'm seeing. So I think if I start adding more bits to it, um, I'm not going to love what I see. So I'm at the point where I feel like if I add anything else, I'm going to spoil it. Um, and that's when I know when to stop. Uh, sometimes, you know, I do go too far. Um, and I'll just keep adding and adding and adding. But yeah, today is not one of those days. Today is, um, I'm quite happy with you know with where we are and i'm loving it so let's have a quick look at our card so that is the front sprinkle kindness wherever you go then you open it up and it says you are awesome live the life you love capture this moment daydream and thank you how lovely is that and then we we'll just finish it off with a little fish on the back so that is it for today guys thank you so much for watching do check out the design team they've been working with these with the cute treasures um, and do an amazing job. Oh, so proud of them. Um, so this is Casper the Cat, which is our lovely Michelle. Do go over to the Facebook group. I check her out there. So that's where she sh um, makes as well as Instagram. So do go and check her out. Uh, but that is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. And hopefully we'll see you again in another video very soon. But until then, happy crafting. Bye.